So let's talk about chromatography applications in the petroleum industry. That is huge. In fact, I will argue the reason chromatography exists is probably because of the petroleum industry. If you go back to 1956, the year GC was invented, it was invented really to solve petroleum industry problems. Uh, back then, we would try and figure out what's in a sample by distillation. So it would take eight hours to distill a really nasty uh, flammable uh, mixture. In chromatography, we could do that same thing. Instead of eight hours, we could do it in eight minutes. So in the petroleum industry, you have a pretty wide variety of applications that all fall into the GC, mostly GC and some HPLC uh, region. We could start with the permanent gases. Uh, I mean, you need to look at uh, you know methane, ethane, propane. You need to look at oxygen. There can't be too much oxygen in the, in the system, otherwise it can cause a giant explosion in the refinery. We look at hydrogen, we look at nitrogen, carbon dioxide, carbon monoxide. So those are traditional GC applications. Moving up the scale, if you think about crude oil containing a thousand compounds, the lightest ones are going to be those permanent gases. But then we start getting into our butanes, our propane butane, um, our liquefied petroleum gases. And so now we're, we're also a GC application. Um, but now we're looking at things that are slightly higher, higher boilers. As we go up that scale, we start to look at our gasoline, kerosene, jet fuels. Uh, those are higher boilers, so we need um, a little higher temperature. We need temperature programming in the GC world. When we get to the really high end of the, the resids, um, uh, so at this point we're talking about really HPLC, where we have this really heavy, thick stuff, or polymers that are made from our, uh, from our petroleum uh, 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 products. Um, those are high molecular weight, so now we're going to need the HPLC world. So you can see that petroleum, uh, the petroleum industry really needs uh, chromatography at every step of the way. So I think back to my time in the petroleum industry. I used to work for Amoco, a wonderful uh, large petroleum company, now known as British Petroleum. And uh, in my group, my last group, we had 110 GCs and we had two HPLCs. So that gives you an idea that the petroleum industry really focused uh, on volatile compounds, therefore GC applications. So um, we've had the opportunity to, to help lots of people in the petroleum industry, and we want to extend that to you. So uh, please come by. Um, and if you have questions, if I didn't talk about one of your applications, or you have some really neat ideas, send that to me. I love learning new things. I learn it from my students. Uh, so if you have questions about chromatography in the petroleum industry, or some comments or some ideas, uh, please let us know.